All right, guys, we're going to go over the three more popular rifle to pistol transi transition methods. Uh, you have your rotation and stow, your underneath grip and drop, or your over the top and drop. Um, I'm going to put them all on the clock, and we're going to see uh, how they look, and then we're going to weigh the pros and cons of each one. Let's go ahead and take a look at this target, just so you know I wasn't shooting at thin air. Um, I got all my hits except one pistol Charlie, okay? Um, I wanted to make sure I got sights on everything and uh, got my hits, um, just to keep it fair across the board um, and show no bias. Um, but uh, you saw with the times, uh, anywhere from like that 1.3 to 1.5 mark, so there's really no big difference uh, in the transition. Um, you know, the biggest question is like, what are you doing after? Um, are you going to continue to uh, walk with your pistol out? Uh, do you want that in between your legs? Are you running a can? Um, uh, maybe that makes it too long for you. Uh, do you have access to your magazines? So like maybe the flip out to, to stow back here so you have access to your magazines. All that goes into the, the, the question. Uh, so I highly advise not to push somebody. Um, as an instructor, I highly advise you not to push people into something specific because you're biased towards it. Um, you know, whatever works for them, let them do it and whatever's comfortable. Uh, the, the more you do it, stick with them, the more you do it, uh, the faster you're going to get with it, uh, just like anything. Um, so hopefully this kind of helped you guys out. Uh, stay safe. We'll see you on the next one.